COVID-19 Update, Wednesday, March 25, 2020. There's a lot going on. Here are today's COVID-19 updates that you should know. Your daily dose of hope. The White House and Congress agreed on a $2 trillion economic stimulus bill to help businesses and individuals impacted by COVID-19. The bill, described as the largest rescue package in U.S. history, includes cash payments of up to $1,200 for individuals and a $350 billion fund for small businesses. Wall Street was volatile early Wednesday, but soared later in the day after Washington passed the stimulus bill. On Tuesday, a Wall Street rally saw the Dow post its best day in nearly 90 years. Researchers studying the coronavirus say it isn't mutating quickly, suggesting vaccines created for COVID-19 could have broad, long-lasting effect. The lockdown in London promises an upside, clear skies. Experts expect non-existent traffic across the city to fuel a continued decline in air pollution that began in mid-February. Experts say COVID-19 treatments could emerge much sooner than a vaccine, which is expected to take a year or more. News you need to know. The U.S. has 55,243 confirmed cases of COVID-19, the third highest after China and Italy. Small businesses that have seen demand drop or have been forced to close are running out of cash. The number of confirmed COVID-19 cases climbed to 2,400 across Africa, prompting warnings that the pandemic could quickly overwhelm the country's limited health services. Data point of the day. Embedded content from ourworldindata.org. Quote of the day, ring the bells that still can ring forget your perfect offering, there is a crack in everything, that's how the light gets in. Leonard Cohen. Are your employees okay? Help is here to assist individuals, teams, and companies navigating these difficult times. Learn more.